Look at all that junk. What a mess. This is my back patio. Not what I envisaged when I was planning to move into this house. I had all these plans for drinks and barbecues and kids dancing all on this patio. And I was so looking forward to it. Now look at it. It turned out this way because on the last day of the move, I ran out of time and I told the removalist, just take everything and put it in the new house back patio. So here it is. So now it's a matter of uh, sorting through the junk and cleaning this place up before I start inviting people over. I mean, I can't show people all this mess, right? I mean, what does it say about my house? But the rest of the house is great though. The front patio, living room, dining room, kitchen, family room, they're all exactly as I planned it. I love my house. But still, if uh, people come over, they'll see this junk. I can't show them this junk. Once I clean it up, they can come. But with so much here, will I ever clean it all up? Will I ever end up inviting anyone to my house? Doesn't that sound so much like how we view ourselves and our lives? All of us have a part of ourselves we want to clean up. The part we don't want other people to see. I live in perpetual mode of holding off inviting people into my life to show them what I'm really like. Because I live in the forlorn hope that the junk inside of me I will one day clean up. Then I'll be good enough to show other people. Only that junk never gets all cleaned up. And I end up never showing others who I am. Because I'm not good enough. No matter how nice the rest of me is, I can't show people my junk. And maybe that's useful sometimes. To keep some dignity, some privacy. I don't have to show every flaw to every person. It's useful to hide some things from some people. But the one person I can't hide anything from is myself. I will always know the junk that sits in the dark corners of my life. No matter how beautiful the rest of my house is, I will always know there is junk. I will know where it is, and I will know what that junk looks like. I live in perpetual mode of holding off, inviting myself to live my own life to the fullest, to show myself who I can be, because I live in the forlorn hope that that junk that sits inside of me, I will one day clean up. Then I'll be good enough to face myself. I think it's time to start accepting that my house has a patio with junk. And my house is beautiful with a patio and that junk. I think it's time for me to invite people to my house. For them to see this beautiful, imperfect house. And I think my friends would like that.